Country View. This is your Wildcat. Welcome for Wednesday, February 3rd already. Yee. Yikes. And we have a birthday to celebrate today. Yay. So a happy birthday is going to Cameron J in third grade. Happy Yay. birthday. Happy birthday on a beautiful Wednesday. A Wildcat Wednesday. Yeah. We got our Wildcat shirts on this rush hour. Mm -hmm. We're jamming here to Wildcat Wednesday at Country View. Love okay. it. So we got our shirts on. And this month, I think you told me we're having a new focus. We are. We're going to be focusing on being safe mm -hmm. because... It is so important that we are safe at school, um, specifically being staying six feet apart from each other. So that means during lining up times, during dismissal and arrival, and even during recess when we're playing together, we still need to maintain our six foot of distance and use our airplane arms. Oh, there it is. There's the airplane arms. <laughs> that is a lot of distance, and that's what we need, Miss Rush Hour. Like... This has my, been my biggest noticing this week and a half of having so many beautiful friends back here, which warms my heart, but we have got to stay safe by staying six feet apart. And that's hard, right? Like mm -hmm. just as humans, we just want to congregate together. We want to, you know, just hug and love each other up. And though right now we need to stay safe by staying apart. So you said it, like, especially when we're walking to and from places and the really hard part is at recess, but it's okay. We can stay six feet apart and still holler at our friends at recess. And I've noticed some kids having lots of fun staying safe outside at recess with all the beautiful snow. Love it. I love <laughs> it. Well, on this day that we pause and remind ourselves to stay safe. This national day is just kind of, I'm sure there's people out there that love this national day. A couple of them in my family, if I do believe. <laughs> so today's national day is National Carrot Cake Day. Yeah, that's not my favorite thing in the world at mm -hmm. all. No. no, I mean, it's real cute and everything. How like, you know, bakers decorated oh, carrot frost. Mm. So... No. Yeah, you know, the, the one thing I can say that I like about carrot cake is the frosting, the cream oh. frosting. I could eat bowls of that without the cake. But, that, you know, there are people in this world that love carrot cake. That's what I always have to make for my daughter on her birthday is carrot cake and my dad. Wow. Yeah. I mean, again, if you love carrot cake, go ahead and eat some today. It's a special yeah. day. <laughs> It is a special day, and I've noticed sometimes Quick Trip has carrot cakes because they have a little carrot frosting. So that is one what place, friends, where you could go find some carrot cake if that's your thing. So, <laughs> well, okay, Miss Rush Hour. Mm -hmm. Today we need to learn something very important because, again, we're honoring this month as Black History Month. So I can't wait for you to tell us some individual who is extremely important. All right, today we have Bessie Coleman. Bessie Coleman was the first African-American woman to obtain an international pilot's license. So soaring into new heights that black people in the United States had never reached before. But as a black woman in the 1920s, she faced many obstacles because of her race and gender. And she said, the air is the only place free from prejudice. Oh, Miss Rush Hour, that is amazing. Like, amazing. Like, I, this is it, truly incredible. And what an incredible human being. You know, yesterday when we talked about, um, Shirley Chisel mm -hmm. with, and you know, she said that she had guts. That's what we'd remember her from, right? I would say that Bessie Coleman was another human with guts. Um, what an incredible mm -hmm. fact about a beautiful African-American woman. 
So right. thank you, Ms. Hour. Mm-hmm. Amazing. Mm-hmm. Well, friends, I am Mrs. Bean. And I'm Miss Rush Hour. Make it a wacky Wildcat Wednesday. And we'll see you at our next Wildcat Welcome.